Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I am Kareem Clemens. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for following me. This right here is Kareem in the morning. At this time, I would like to run my disclaimer. This channel and these videos are not meant for children under the age of 13. Omega Studio News, Talk Show T, Content Warning, Kareem in the Morning, you must be over the age of 18. Okay, thank you so much for being here. This is Kareem in the morning. Hello, how are you doing on this beautiful day that the Lord has made? Okay, so I am going to go ahead and bring up my, uh, yep, okay, so I wanted, oh, go back to, welcome to Kareem in the morning. Again, I'm Kareem. Thank you so much. This is going to be uh, short, straight to the point. All right, because I have everything right here on my uh, itinerary, or should I say the manifest, and I forgot one more thing, phone. All right, so welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, before I want to say happy Friday, I'm the host, Kareem Clemens. The show is sponsored by Omega Studio News, Talk Show T, and Talk Show T TV on YouTube, and copyrighted date for this month. Okay, and as I uh, want to remove that, and before I continue, I want to start off with breaking news. I want to start off with this important clip before I move on. While I move on this next story or this story, uh, enjoy this clip right here. I want you to listen to it before I move on. So. Yeah. I mean, who? says empire this MAGA country ties a noose around your neck and pours bleach on you and this is just a friendly fight i will never be the man that this did not happen to i am forever changed i want to say the reason why i played that is because the brother is forever changed. Yes, he is forever changed. I want to go to here and why he is forever changed because the disgraced Jesse Smollett was found guilty. Okay. He was found guilty on five out of six counts. Okay. So Jesse Smollett found guilty. And as you can see right here, the disgraced actor Jesse Smollett was found guilty on five of six felony counts of disorderly conduct of making false report to Chicago police and that he was the victim of a hate crime in January of 2019. You guys can go up on Omega Studio News or on the blog page and check out the Jesse Smaller reaction video. Uh, as the verdict was coming in, I was able to give you guys live my reaction right there. I was really, really hoping that he was found guilty on all six counts but he was found guilty on uh, the first five and the sixth count was, uh, which he was found not guilty on was, 
the uh, uh, falsifying, I believe it was falsifying. Uh, okay, yeah, he was not. He was not found guilty on the sixth charge of telling a second detective he was an aggravated battery victim. So that is the reason why he was found not guilty on that, but the other charges he was found guilty. What you're looking at right here is the envelope that was mailed over through the parcel service. Like I said, then I'll say it again. This man needs to uh, have federal charges brought up against him because he committed this crime. Okay, they were waiting. The FBI was waiting for DNA and uh, fingerprints to come back. We see this as we see here. It shows the stick man. It doesn't show. Um, it shows a, a gun, uh, but it also shows a uh, the rope around the neck and the big guy, which would indicate the Osadara brother and also the little stick old me. All right, the biracial man, the disgraced Jesse Smollett. Because his mom is African American and his father is a Jewish Jew, and he is not black. Uh, he labeled himself as the Jewish gay man, okay? But he said himself he's gay man, all right? But anyway, it is what it is, okay? I just had to put that in archive because people were asking me, well, what is it? Is he black? Is he white? Is he? Listen, he's biracial, okay? So here you see him guilty, and it is what it is. I really hope that federal charges be brought up against him. But again, I knew I was right on the fact that this man uh, was going to be found guilty. Okay, so the disgraced Jesse Smollett, guilty of falsifying reports of a hate crime. All right, so moving right along, moving right along. Okay, so... We have some breaking news right now. Uh, I do want to go to breaking news, which is happening right now. Okay, so this part is social media news and breaking news. So right now on this day, the late Senator Robert J. Dole, who passed away uh, 1923 to 2021, Senator uh, Funeral Service is or was or have happened at the Memorial Service, Memorial Service National Cathedral. Uh, where hundreds pay their respect to the senator, uh, including Biden, President Biden, who actually eulogized something. You guys can go on social media and look and uh, uh, actually uh, follow that story on here. All right. Okay. So next, we have some breaking news to tell you right here in the sports world. Uh, I can tell you that we have lost a player, formal NF NFL player. Okay, formal NFL star Demarius Thomas, dead at the age of 33. Okay, you guys can see him right here. Uh, so Demarius Thomas uh, died at his home in Roswell, Georgia at the age of 33. Thomas was considered one of the best wide receivers in Denver Bronco history. Uh, they are saying that it is devastating and completely heartbreaking. Uh, the Broncos re released a statement saying, Demarius, humanity, warm, kindness, and infectious smile will always be remembered by those who he knew and, and, and who loved him. Okay? So they you can go up on Denver Broncos uh, and their uh, uh, Twitter at Broncos, and you can read the devastating, uh, the devastating post that they post up there, and also in honor of of uh, Demarius Thomas, uh, a statement from the Denver Broncos. Okay, so you guys can go up there, and you guys can uh, tune into that. All right. Okay, so. This story is next is around the world. Okay. So, yes. Yeah, so, happy Friday. News from around the country and around the world. Okay. So, happy Friday. So, this is just some of the stories that are happening. Uh, I can tell you that WikiLeaks founder is uh, can be extradited to the U.S. 
uh, for facing spy charges. UK is appealing the court's rule. Uh, truck crash kills 55 migrants and injuring dozens more in the southern Mexican. Okay. And then on the other side, it says Travis Scott story. Travis Scott is sitting down with Charlemagne the God and explaining his part uh, and what happened and, and, and just a really touching story. You guys can go up on social media to find that story out. And as you can see, this is the, this is the crowd that basically was uh, happening that night. And last but not least, yes, we can say that Michael Strahan, uh, host of uh, Good Morning America, is about to take a trip in space. Bitch, I said it right. He is about to take a trip in space. Uh, you guys can go up on the, uh, social media and uh, definitely, definitely get your life on all these stories around the country and around the world. And at this time, I would like to add in inspirational quotes. Inspirational quotes, I try to get this, uh, try to give you guys some inspirational quotes throughout the day. So when you are looking at my video and you may have, you may have a frown and then you want to turn that frown into a smile. So here, always remember that uh, you're not in jail, not in the hospital, not in the grave. Thank you, God, for another day. My favorite, never give up, stay positive, stay focused, and stay strong. I don't know who this is for, but I just heard that the Lord says, don't give up. And as you take another breath, someone takes their last. Stop complaining and appreciate it life. And I want to also add to that, uh, remember that somebody always got it worse than you. That's what I want to add to that. Okay? And uh, let me just add up here. And thank you guys for joining me right here, right now on Kareem in the Morning. Uh, you can follow me on Kareem J. Clemens on Facebook. Also, you guys can follow me on Twitter. Yes, I do have a Twitter. Okay. And also YouTube. All right. So, guys. Thank you for joining me on Kareem in the morning, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. For more information, you guys can visit the blog page. Have a good one.